Does this look like a submarine to you guys? Because it really does look like a submarine to me. But the fact is, it doesn't dive. So, nevertheless, let's call it a torpedo boat. Welcome back, guys. Griffel here. Nice, wonderful Christmas break. Again, hopefully you all had a wonderful Christmas. Hopefully you all got what you wanted. But here I'm going to show you an interesting concept I uh, kind of uh, sketched up here uh, in Worship Craft. This was going to be a torpedo boat. And then I was like, well, now let's make it a submarine. But I couldn't make it dive and do all the submarine -y stuff. And I thought I turned off notifications. So I have a, an interesting color scheme going on here. Um, it's like a white and blue-ish. I, I don't really like it. I don't think this is what I want to get my fleet's colors into. And it's just, mostly this is just to show of a concept model. <laughs> Sorry about that. And this thing is really capable of uh, dealing some good old damage. Um, bear, me, bear with me right here. These right here are some uh, air intakes to cool down the engines, okay? Just, just bear with me. We have two torpedo tubes right here and here on both sides of the ship. We have a nice reconnaissance aircraft to give ourselves some better viewing range on the enemy ships. Uh, we have two OTO Malera 76 millimeters and one 127 millimeter 54 Mark 45 and I thought this was going to be enough but of course you had to have at least one VLS Tomahawk and these three guns at the front are no good without a Spy 1 radar hull and there's no way to just add one without making it look stupid so I had to add two and then finally there was one thing when I was testing the ship out where am I going to get protection from other vertical launch missiles? And the answer lied right here in this CIWS. This thing can intercept most uh, missiles. And uh, it's a really good protection for the ship. And it's, it's a really fun ship to play with. And it can, it can take a nice pounding. Uh, we got some interesting design cues back here in the back. Uh, something just a little cool, I think. How the uh, it's not flush, but it kind of cuts off there. But enough rambling. Let's go show you how this ship can sail. So this thing does love to cruise at a nice, uncomfortable speed of 95 knots, and it, it just looks spectac spectacular, spectacular in the water here. Uh, I love the little um, radars I put side with radars. It's like a fan, but. It's just something different, you know what I mean? Uh, I got some anti-aircraft guns in the back here, just in case we got some uh, bogeys on our six. And another nice thing is that you slam in the left, it doesn't tilt around like crazy. It just turns nice and strong without tilting. This thing is really nice and planted in the water, and it just looks interesting while driving it. So I, I know you guys want me to uh, try it, doing the airbase, not the multi-stage airbase, but the airbase. And it, it's kind of an interesting, um, it, it plays out interesting. So we're here at the airbase, and the thing is, we can get to the airbase if no dive bombers get to us, or at least they don't hit us, because these three guns down here are really efficient at picking off aircraft. And I'll demonstrate, oh, let's launch this uh, vertical launch missile. And Okay. Uh, the audio might be super loud right now, so I'm trying to like yell over the sound of warship craft. But just watch how effective these guns are. Once the once those planes get in range, I'm gonna have my OTO Maleras just wipe them out of the sky. Just wipe it up, man. They do. They clean up the job really nicely. They are efficient at this. Thing. It's not even funny. So now it's getting really loud, and I hope you can still hear me. We're still trying to get some of the, uh, so we're not getting hit by any dive bombers so far. So if we can keep this up, we will be fine, and we'll be able to take out the airbase. I can't believe it. We've made it through. That was some crazy hectic, uh, 
garbage right there. Let's, oh, dude, dude. So let's take out this air base right now. This is beautiful, guys. You see the power of this thing? It's taking hits from the air base and it's not sinking. That is the beauty of this ship. It is a mighty little feisty little torpedo boat. And once this thing gets close in range, those, wow. This is like Samsung, what, Samsung? This is like David and Goliath. This is David, airbase is Goliath. It just shows how much power is in this little torpedo boat. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you want me to make a tutorial on it, uh, let's, get some, uh, let's get some comments down below what you think about it. And like the video. Remember to subscribe if you haven't. This was Griffball, and I will see you guys later.